Hey, good morning. Uh, Kalidowski State Park you got to be very careful with the tides right here the tide is very uh, it's coming up right now we, but we should have maybe waited another half an hour but we got our buddy boat over here rum wild and uh, we're gonna come out and head down uh, the canal here so when you're coming in to Kalidowski you gotta be very very careful and watch your tides right now I'm showing seven feet under the keel out front cleaning up the lines and uh, keeping out for shallow but I'm just gonna follow my line right out Leaving here on an incoming tide. High tide is about uh, 12:45. It's about 9:15 right now, and the tide's coming in. So we'll see what happens here. But it looks like it's going to be pretty uneventful because I'm seeing the same numbers that I saw coming out. You know, it might be a little bit lower, but not much. That was a little mirror bracking. We haven't made it yet, but we got to make it over to those buoys right there before we make our turn into the channel. That's uh, John's Pass, I believe. Just for you guys to know, all I'm doing is following my path, so I want those two red lines to line up. 8.2 feet of water, I've been maintaining that pretty consistently. So we made our turn, and now we head over to the canal. That was a piece of cake, actually. Anybody wanted to try that, that, was, that wasn't really that big of a deal. It's shallowest I saw underneath the keel was five feet. So we made the turn and now we just hold this heading to Gulfport, Florida. We'll be visiting family. Daisy in her spot this morning. You got enough shade, girl? Huh? You all good? I love you. Good morning. You can see Clearwater over here to our right. So you can see it, we're real close to downtown Clearwater right now. Chuck and Debbie used to live. We used to have family that lived right here.
houses everywhere, arenas everywhere. Be a beautiful place to stay for a week or so. Do some exploring. Let's talk a little bit about why I'm doing the loop. I'm doing it to hone my boat skills and uh, keep moving forward. I mean, the next thing after I finish the loop, I want to go to the Bahamas and uh, keep the keys and then go over to the Bahamas. And the big picture then is uh, once that trip is done, then head over to uh, the Panama Canal and then go to Alaska. Now, uh, Prince S is not capable of trips like that. And that's why we are uh, currently gonna switch boats just for the Bahama. And then it would be another switch to do the Panama Alaska trip. But I got big dreams, that's all I can say. There's John's Pass. We're going past here right around 12 o'clock noon. Within about 10 miles of where we're going for tonight. Beverly and Daisy from the Loop Princess. Thank you so much for watching. Here's to salt under your keel and safe voyages. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you.